Hey Sagittarius, this is Ascension Empress with your bonus reading. At first I was like, this is about to be y'all January 2022. No, it's your bonus. Okay. Sagittarius, again, I know it's Capricorn season, but happy birthday. Maybe it's a Capricorn in here or someone with Capricorn energy and you got Sagittarius too, y'all. Still sending y'all so much love and light. Thank you so much for all of the wishes, the well wishes when it comes to my family and my dad, the birthday wishes. I appreciate y'all so, so much. Okay, so we're going to go. Ooh, wee. look at that. Yeah, the Knight of Cups already. So we're going to go ahead and get into it and see what messages Spirit has for you. And thank you all again for your patience and booking with me. I'm not taking personals at this time, only emergency readings. But I will keep y'all updated on when I'm open again soon. Okay, this is nice. Mm, Knight of Cups here. Knight of Cups, what else do we have, Spirit? Ooh, that was wow somebody definitely wants to offer you love or they're already seeing you in this energy of being an overflow and very grateful loving on yourself staying hydrated all right mm -hmm. spirit what, what's who is this <laughs> get right to it let's be direct who is this spirit some y'all could be dealing with the water sign but i do see someone wants to make an offer look at that queen of swords y'all Whew. Definitely water time for somebody. Somebody could be dealing with the Scorpio and spirit. I feel like this Queen of Swords is many of y'all. You could have air in your chart. Or y'all are just very aware at this time. Your intuition could even be telling you that there's an offer coming in, or you know, if you as soon as you make a decision, that yeah, I'm hearing yes. That's the yes here. There's the certainty around you know spirit granting you favor. Okay, and they may have to do with this transformation here. Right. And somebody could also be offering you condolences. Yeah, because I see someone trying to stay strong here, you know, trying to, you know, have mind. Yeah. Mm, keep their head strong. But there's a lot of emotions behind this Queen of Swords that I'm picking up and it could be due to a passing here. So sending y'all my condolences. Let's see, Spirit. What do you want them to know about this death card? Huge transformation, y'all. Some of y'all could have Scorpio in your chart. What's going on with this? Okay. Yes. Wow. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yes. Queen of Swords is making itself known. Right? And there's judgment. I'm hearing a judgment call. But I'm picking up on this clarity that you're receiving. Is in this it could be this person coming in. This person is confirmation to whatever you were feeling, what you've seen. Some vision is coming into fruition. And mm, I'm hearing you really put your mind to it and now judgment is here there's a transformation y'all are about to see this birth this death of you know what you were going through what you had to put in okay and there's about to be this birth there's about to be this rebirth right and i feel like it has a lot to do with you know this christmas energy the solstice energy the uh, everything okay so take it how it resonates whether you know whatever you believe in because we did come out of that set we came out of that Sagittarius energy, right? Okay, and there's still the solar eclipse is playing a huge role. Yeah, with you, Sagittarius. <laughs> so yeah, we about to get into this. This is some messages coming through, y'all. What's going on with the um the judgment? What would you like Sagittarius to be aware of when it comes to I'm hearing their judgment? Yeah, your judgment as far as a decision and mm. Wow. Yeah, y'all. Protect your energy. Okay, that's why. That is why, y'all. Really? <laughs> the Knight of Wands and the King of Wands. Okay? That, I mean, not even just the Knight or just the King. And it had just happened to be the Wands. Right? I mean, no surprise here, y'all. And some of y'all, this is, this is your energy when it comes to this energy coming towards you. And I'm also picking up on, you know, you... Mm-hmm. There's a mental strength here. And I was talking to Aquarius about this not too long ago. You know, having the mental discipline. And it's not, yeah, right? And I was just talking to an Aquarius this morning. And he was talking about, you know, having the mindset. Having the mindset. And so there could be, yep, there's a change here. There's a change here. And how you see things going forward 
is changing it, it got this masculine hot okay it got it got them passionate maybe a little angry because i get that they want to come in but they're now they're having to tame themselves maybe because of how you're communicating or what you have going on here right but this knight of wands i'm telling you i feel like yeah for many of y'all it's the same person y'all could be dealing with another fire sign okay <laughs> or it could just be yes i'm here within the next three days something is going on where oh y'all and that's new years okay so let's just let's be direct again spirit what's going on with this nine of wands okay this energy that's coming in i'm picking up they want to come in impulsively but they're gonna try they're gonna try to tame themselves but it's not taking away the fact that they're coming in with this wand energy y'all okay what else do we need to look at the moon mm. be careful because there is there's a lot of clarity here right y'all may have the gift of insight your intuition and you've made a decision or you communicated something and you're sticking to it spirit is about to test you and see that right spirit is about to test you and see are you sticking to what you say because this person coming in and they coming in may be secretive or they're uh -huh, or it's a surprise here okay what all the spirit what do we need to know about the moon card yep yep you ain't gonna know <laughs> y'all look i'm over here talking it could be me too right two of swords y'all Somebody's also, you know, undecided. They're, they still have some stuff going on and they want to come in. They they are attracted to you. But I feel like y'all are attracted to what makes sense, right? Because if somebody, yeah, this is that energy of like, if you can't even act right or think, mm -hmm, think twice, that's not even like, I can't even match this fire. And y'all are the fire sign, right? So y'all are definitely, that's what it is. Y'all, I, I said, you got the mental discipline. You're not thinking with your, you know, man or woman. You're not thinking with your wand energy. There's this vision that many of y'all have, okay? Look at that. Yeah, you're not interested in disappointment, regret. Yeah, you're, temp look at that now. Temperancing yourself. Look. Okay, and this person, they could be coming in, you know, acting like they don't know what you're talking about or guilt tripping and playing, you know, like they have regrets. They could be coming in regretful. Spirit says still, <laughs> temperance yourself. Temperance your energy. Maybe if you do have air in your chart, temperance that, y'all. Okay, with this fire and this passion because I feel like, wait a minute, yeah, because Spirit never said y'all ain't attracted. Okay, I just feel like there is this turn off. There is some this is somebody you've dealt you dealt with before or you see you see right through them. That's just the I mean that's the collective energy that we picked up on earlier. And this is y'all's card, right? So there's this patient. Mm -hmm, there's this patience here. And balance as well when it comes to a codependency, a habit, or something that just it doesn't serve you. If somebody's giving you a drink, be mindful or be mindful of this offer. Yeah, somebody's giving somebody a drink here. Nine of Cups with the Ace of Cups. And then there's this mixing. There's this intention here as well. Okay. What do you want Sagittarius to be aware of when it comes to this devil? And yeah, okay, somebody's coming in for an opportunity, right? They, they All they see is an opportunity with this devil card, okay? This could be somebody that you work with or they're, you know, this Venus and Capricorn energy could really be playing a huge role, right? Not only is it, you know, retrograde energy, but it's going to be in Capricorn for a minute, right? So I'm, I'm picking up on false start. Somebody could be coming in, you know, making an offer, but it's still, mm -mm. Spirit said, you know, something about that judgment, right? Use your judgment. Do you want to be disappointed? Because there's some, yeah, do you want to be disappointed? Because there's something that you're not seeing and this person is coming in fast and, you know, coming in strong with, and look, patience. You may have to come in. I'm picking up on strength energy. Y'all may be temperancing this. And then, yep, yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> this person ain't going to know how to. <laughs> You're going to leave this person all up in their head. Or you, okay? Take care of resonate, Sagittarius. Okay? Because the word, the, mm, yeah, I'm hearing the words can be reversed. I was going to say the the roles and there's something going on. Yeah, y'all not about to sit up here and let somebody play you. Okay? I did say direct, direct to the point. Okay? And that may be how y'all are communicating because you're done with the you're not you don't even want seven cups okay you're moving forward with no i feel like some of y'all were in this energy okay but now this person is in this that's another reason why they're coming in so fiery passionate and maybe even aggressive right 
not in a very not in an abusive way um but they do have a lot going on that they're still needing to work through this person has some type of fear because you're also moving towards a new, new mm -hmm, can't even get it out yeah i'm hearing the new beginning here all right what else would you like sagittarius is that the Ooh, i almost picked it Ooh, honey i said i pictured it i thought it was the six of wands but didn't i just say y'all okay the strength card i'm picturing somebody taming this lion, this pride, this masculine energy who may be coming in, you know, wanting to sniff and see what's going on with you, right? And in your beliefs, they're being tested. Your your strength, your discipline is being tested. Your courage to be able to release how it used to be. So many of y'all are being called to take the lead. Yes, go after this Ace of Pentacles energy. This person may be coming along too, but spirit about to handle that, y'all. Spirit handling, yeah. Mm -hmm. They watching. Somebody watching here. You got the page. I feel like this is somebody else. Dang, y'all. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> you and this person could have a lot of similar placements, or they're matching your energy. Um, there's something here that I mean. Ooh, ee, this person could be coming off very cold. They could come off like they got a smart mouth. Okay, and you like I can I do too, right? But there's this maturity that's taking place here with the eight of cups. Mm, as soon as I said smart mouth, right? And that could be what's being released here. Somebody, okay. And y'all could get a message here as well. Some communication with the page of swords from an air sign. Spirit is making this air energy very uh prominent okay so let's see what any other advice yeah seven of cups yeah oh, that's why don't let nobody manipulate you and cause confusion that's what this is y'all all this air energy with the devil here and the seven of cups and you're already being called to step into this be careful now look plotting and planning strategizing be careful now three again three of pentacles and the three of wands like i said in that reading not too long ago don't forget about your plans. <laughs> Ooh, honey. You ain't gonna regret it. What are you building? Do you want to continue to go in the cycle of disappointment because somebody is one disappointed that you're moving forward because you don't want to wait in this toxic cycle with them? What? Are you gonna sacrifice this for another one of these? Look at that. No. <laughs> Many of y'all are like, no, no. That's why we're here. <laughs> okay. So what advice do you have, Spirit? What would you like those who actually really are, they're moving on. They're not just thinking about it. They're moving on. Okay. What do you want them to know, Spirit? Mm? Anything else? Yeah. Blessed. Not only the Ten of Pentacles, but the Ten of Cups. Okay. You won't regret it. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles again. Ace of Pentacles again. New. Ooh, wee. And protect your energy too i'm also picking up on you know savings savings are going to be nice right y'all also the value the self-esteem how you give your time and your energy y'all about to be a lot more selfish about you and your happiness and, and what you want in a healthy way okay this is what's that I feel like the devil, the enemy, or whoever the enemy is definitely using at this time got them just like this. Or they will be. Any other messages for those ready? In the look, see, peace of mind. Peace of mind and a new perspective, right? Another lesson, another jewel on your crown. Y'all, what's the soul journey message, spirit? What is the soul journey message? Thank you, doubt. Wow. Peace and doubt. Which one? Right? You see how the enemy come in and play? I told you about all this air energy. And look at you, though. So this could be somebody who's coming in, you know, with this king of wands energy. Also, you know, trying to talk a good game. They It sound good. Y'all, I've been getting that message for so long. It sound good. Right, and they may even be certain, but it's something that they're still not dealing with that is causing doubt. While your uh, spirit already gave you advice on those who moving forward, peace, four swords energy. Okay, there's doubt here. I release the need to know all the answers, and that's what somebody is gonna have to do because 
if you if you're not in the energy of needing to know all the answers you wouldn't be in this energy you or somebody else would not be in this energy you would be in peace right i am a being of love and i release all the negative energy that is not this and y'all are realizing that too that's why you're stepping to the eight of cups you're like i don't even want that would bring yes that's what you're realizing entertaining this this person or too fast or buying what they're selling too fast whatever okay because i feel like there is potential for somebody here for this person to get it together but spirit didn't say just sit there and wait now okay <laughs> spirit said act like you know this person may come in again smart mouth or know-it-all or whatever but you're releasing that y'all are in that eight of cups energy your being of love, Empress energy, y'all stepping into it, okay? I'm also picking up a, a lot more secretive or just discreet about you. And, I mean, I'm picking up on, it's not a, it's not everybody's business, it's not their business, <laughs> okay? So that's your reading, you all. Thank you again so much for your love and your support. I appreciate y'all so much. Please stay safe and take care. Bye.